Well, hi guys, this is Aniket and we are back with uh, one more shortcut. Yes, today's trick is based on the integration of the definite integration. So, chaliye, without wasting much time, let's quickly get started. Alright, so here we have the trick here. See, whenever we have integral of the time 0 to pi sin ax into cos bx dx, then यहाँ पे सबसे पहले आपको a minus b, a minus b इस टर्म का वैल्यू निकालना है, ओके? Okay? And what is this a minus b? सी देखो यहाँ पे a is nothing but the value associated with this sine वाला टर्म, and this b is nothing but the value associated with this cos वाला टर्म, ओके? Okay? And once you find the value of a minus b, तो देखना यहाँ पे आपको दो पॉसिबिलिटीज मिलेंगे, या तो दिस नंबर a minus b it will be an even number, right? Or ya to it will be an odd number, right? So, agar is term ka value ek even number hai, then the value of this entire integral i, it will be equal to 0, okay? And if the value of this term a minus b, if it is an odd number, then the value of this entire integral, it will be i is equal to 2a upon a square minus b square and that's it all right so this is the wonderful trick that we have in this video guys you can just pause the video and uh, note this down as now we are going to solve some questions by using this trick all right guys so here we have the questions on the board here see for the first one we have sin 8x into cos 2x so here pe 8 minus 2 it is 6 and we all know 6 is an even number so the value of the first integral, it will be straight away a 0, right? Then for the next one, so here pe we have sin 3x into cos 6x. So here pe 3 minus 6, it is minus 3. Minus 3, 3 means it's an odd number. So here pe the answer of this integral will be i is equal to 2 times a, means 2 3s are 6 aega upar, upon a square minus b square. So a square 3 ka square is 9 minus b square 6 ka square is 36. So therefore i will be equal to 6 upon 9 minus 36 is minus 27. So this we can reduce further. It will be 3 twos are upon 3 nines are. So minus 2 by 9 is the final answer. And uh, then for the next one here we have sin 49x into cos 105x so 49 minus 105 it is minus 56 56 matlab it's an even number so straight away the value of this entire integral it will be 0 so i is equal to 0 here and uh, on the similar lines for the last one here we have sin 20x into cos 49x so here we 20 minus 49 it is minus 29 29 matlab it's an odd number so, here pe i will be equal to 2 times a, matlab 2 into 20, it is 40, upon a square minus b square. So, 20 ka square is 400, minus 49 ka square is 2401, 2401 it is. So, therefore, i will be equal to, it will be 40, upon 400 minus 2401, it is minus of 2001. And that's it. So here we have the trick guys. Deko, whenever we are dealing with integrals of the form 0 to pi sin ax into cos bx. So first of all, you have a minus b is term ka value. Alright. So the value of the term a minus b, if it's an even number, then the value of the entire integral, it will be 0. And if the value of the term a minus b, if it's an odd number, then the value of the entire integral, it will be i is equal to 2a upon a square minus b square and that's it and that's all we have in this trick guys agar aaj ka trick aapko acha laga then video ko like share and subscribe karna mat bhuliye thank you so much